Here we are! Franklin Square! Oh, let me turn around, turn around. Go before a walk. And today, I'm gonna walk around the historic district. Oh, let's get you all, let's get you all situated. We are going to walk around the historic district. We're, go, we're going in a little bit of center city. It's very exciting. Everybody's talking about it. It's trending on Twitter. Hashtag, where the hell is he going? Look at this. So coming up very shortly. Um, oh, I think it's, I mean, if it's getting built, it's going to be in the next week or two, or maybe a little bit. These are part of the Chinese Lantern Festival. Oh, is it called the Chinese Lantern Festival or is it just called the Lantern Festival? It, you know what? I don't, yeah, honestly, I think that's what it's called. I was gonna say I don't care, but I obviously I do care. Not really, I don't. Uh, this is, no it is, it's the Chinese Lantern Festival. Now, now I'm all, Oh, I hope I don't get canceled for saying Chinese. Oh, this world. So this is the Franklin Square. It's one of the original parks designed in the original layout of the city. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Fish down. Chaos and anarchy. Oh, no. That wasn't even a big gust of wind. Uh-oh, we're in trouble. They start blowing away on little breezes. Hashtag canceled. Not me, the uh, parade. So, let's see. Oh, it is called the Chinese Lantern Festival. So, huzzah. I still have a job. So, these things will all be built. Uh, they're all handmade. Uh, when's it come back? The Dragon Returns. June 21st. So, today is like June 5th, I think, or around that. Early June. So, they start getting ready to get ready kind of early. Um, I've never been to it. <laughs> I don't, you know, I don't, I'm not paying $30. I don't even know what it is. But, uh, yeah, I don't go to it. Maybe I'll go to it this year. We'll see. So we're just going, going for a little walk. Oh, you know what? Hold on. Pause. You know what's funny? After they're done doing these uh, lantern festivals, they just throw this shit out. They don't really save it. Um, it doesn't really preserve well if you keep it outside. There's a spot in uh, Chinatown. I think it's like 9th and Race. Or 9th. Yeah, I think it's 9th and Race. And they had some of these stay out for like a year. And by the end of the year, they were all deteriorated. It was just wire. So, uh, and then there's a place called Thunderbird Salvage in Fishtown. They, um, <laughs> what they do is they trash pick <laughs> these lanterns and then they sell them in, uh, in their store. So if you're in the market for a giant dragon head, That there is uh, street art. It's a uh, it's it, it's embedded into the street, like I'm about to be. Um, that's made by this artist. His name's Stickman. And there's a technique you have. You just placed you place a little tile into the ground, and then cars will run over them, and then embeds embeds his art into the street. Uh, w H Y Y. 
And uh, if you listen to Terry Gross, Fresh Air, she um, she does well. She used to do the show in there. There she is. Oh shit. Terry Gross. All right. Going in here. This is the Independent Hall Visitor Center. This is a, I'll tell you what, I go here all the time, reason being, uh, there's a bathroom you can use. Oh, what's this? Well, 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 look who it is. There she is. Oh, my yeah, it was, I have, it, this, what happened? Why are we closed? I got the Philly blogger here. Philly blogger. <laughs> uh, I, well, I came to see my old friends from the Carpenter's Hall. It's closed right now. Wow, I just... I just met uh, the guy, like, in charge of all the history tours. Oh, boy. Oh, I, oh do I have some... Oh. Oh, I'm going to be learning some shit. Oh, this is going to be great. Speaking of uh, history, that's a... Uh, call him Ben Franklin. There's my best friend, the Philly Fanatic. This is the, I think one year, they made all these different Philly fanatics, like a themed Philly fanatic, and if you look at his belly, that's the Liberty Bell fanatic. They, um, they auction them off occasionally, the old, the old fanatic Liberty Bells, or the old fanatic dolls from different themed things. You can buy them. And uh, they go for a few thousand dollars. It's crazy. It's, so this is like the visitor center. So you come here, you yeah, learn about the history. This is where you get the tickets for Independence Hall. You got to get time tickets. So you go in here, and usually when the line's real long, you wait in the museum and you you play with the stuff. They have all types of. Um, like, they got this little movie theater, and you get to um, learn about different locations in the city. And then they also have a movie here in this section where they talk about the historic district and what happened here. So, so 1753 is when the Liberty Bell was installed. I think I knew that, but now I know it even more. This is something cool in this. The best view of the city is up here. Uh, it's not open today, but this is something cool that they have on display. This is one of the, uh, the first roach traps in the United States. What they would do, oh, excuse me, so it's a, what they would do is they would put molasses into the bottom of the bowl and roaches would go into the bowl and that's how they would trap uh, roaches. See if my buddy David Washington's here. That's Rocky Balboa, he's the most famous Kenzo. Oh, I hear him. David Washington, how are you, my friend? I'm fine. My friends from Kansas City. Kansas City, uh-oh. Yeah. yeah. They got good barbecue, I hear. Awesome sauce, barbecue. Yeah. So anyway, this is my friend, John the Philly Captain. Please follow his YouTube channel. Yeah. Awesome. The Thanks. Philly Captain. David, <laughs> I'll see you around, buddy. Have a good day. Listen to David Washington's podcast on Spotify. On Spotify. <laughs> oh, I love it. Uh-oh, what's going on here? All right, well, that's just a little tour of what happens. Just two little blocks in Center City, Philadelphia. I think what we're going to do now is we're going to 
start my vlog of the day. Well, make sure you hit like and no. Well, make sure you hit like and subscribe, and I'll sail with you later. Toodles!